November in Panama is a great month to be in Panama. It is also a pretty tricky month to be in Panama. I'm going to tell you about what to expect over the next month of Fiestas Patrias in Panama. So the first one is coming up on the 3rd. That is Independence from Colombia. And then on the 4th, it's Flag Day. On the 5th, it's Colón Day. On the 10th, it is uh, when they first shouted Independence in Los Santos. And on the 28th is when we got Independence from Spain. So that's five different holidays. On those holidays, banks are going to be closed. Okay? On the 3rd and the 4th, there are going to be two different parade routes. One on Calle Cincuenta, one on a La Cinta Costera, so on Balboa Avenue. Uh, they both start at 9 a.m., so it's two different routes this year. If you guys have never been on a, to a parade in Panama, they are magical. Man, kids practice for all year for these parades, and they are beautiful. Um, everybody is in traditional costume. Everybody's playing great music. You get, you know, some of, like, the older guys from, like, Colón coming down, doing, like, Congo dancing and stuff. It's really special, okay? So get to a parade. Also, if you're in the interior, you can expect smaller parades, but certainly parades nonetheless, and celebrations. Of course, the cultural heart of Panama is in the interior, so... Check it out in the interior. Okay, so that's all the good stuff. What about the bad stuff? Well, if you're looking at closing a deal in November, it gets a little tricky. Most lawyers, at least the big lawyers, kind of disappear for the whole month of November. There's a couple of days in there where you can get some work done. Everybody scrambles from like the 6th to the 9th. And from like the last half of November, everybody's trying to jam in all of their work because banks are closed. Grocery stores will still be open. Traffic is a bit nutsos, especially along the parade route. Parades usually run for about three hours in Panama, so figure half a day on the 3rd and half a day on the 4th. Don't drive around the city. It's just going to be a bit of a mess. Now, the nice thing about the city in Panama, the Panama City, is that, hey, people leave, so it's kind of empty. After the parades, it's super tranquilo, as they say. But stay tuned. We are going to be shooting live videos from the parades, live videos from the parties. There's always so much going on in the month of November. It's not a bad month to come down to Panama. Um, it's still kind of finishing up our rainy season. It's a little rainy outside today. But hey, what can you do? Um, you, there will also be some great days as well. It's nice to get out to the beach. Just beware. If you're trying to leave, for example... Like, this weekend, oh, forget about it. It's going to be a bit nuts. Same thing right before uh, the 10th. But, uh, hey, now you know. And knowing is half the battle. So, anyway, guys, have a great day. And uh, thanks for watching.